This is How to Drink, the show about making cocktails and how to drink them. I'm Greg, and I have never been a professional bartender. I've never even had a job in a bar. I don't worry too much about precision in technique, because at the end of the day, if the drink you like is in the glass, you did it right. Let's get going. Uh, so we're going to make a uh, Jungle Bird, and I'm calling it a Jungle Bird Bianco. Jungle Bird is a uh, tiki drink from the late tiki period. I think from the late 60s or early 70s. Today we are partnered up with our good friends at Luxardo and Anchor Distilling, and we're going to make our Jungle Bird with Bitter Bianco, which is a potable bitter much in the same family as Campari, but without any artificial dyes or coloring. And uh, I think that it does a fine job of making a Jungle Bird. So let's call it a Jungle Bird Bianco. So we're gonna make this drink in our shaker tin. We're gonna start with a half an ounce of Demerara syrup. Demerara syrup is nothing more than inverse simple syrup made with Demerara sugar. Demerara sugar is a less refined form of sugar. Our next ingredient will be two ounces of pineapple juice. I have this fresh squeezed pineapple juice in a bottle right here. You could also buy pineapple juice. Um, I would think it's best to use fresh pineapple juice, uh, but if you really want to, go ahead and get the stuff in the can won't hurt you, it's fine. Anyway, two ounces of fresh pineapple juice. Ooh, look at that, that's delicious. Have you ever drank fresh pineapple juice? Because... That is awesome. That is like a Caribbean breakfast, it's so good. Uh, I need a half an ounce of lemon juice to get that. I'm gonna cut this lemon in half. And in it goes. So now we need a half an ounce of lime juice. I got my lime here. I'm um, gonna throw that in. And boom. And that is a half an ounce. Now I need three quarters of an ounce of my Bitter Bianco. Uh, and now I need an ounce and a half of uh, black rum. And we're going to use Hamilton uh, Jamaican pot still black rum. So an ounce and a half, in she goes. Delicious black rum. Uh, we're going to shake this drink over cracked ice. And then we're going to serve it over a big old cube. Let's pour this drink gated so that we keep all of our ice in our tin. And I'm going to gently pour it right over the top of that cube. I think three pineapple fronds and an orchid will do wonders here. All right, so there it is, a Jungle Bird Bianco made with Luxardo's Bitter Bianco. Let's see how it is. Oh, man. The evolution in that drink is very complicated. It is bitter but sweet, and there's some banana I always get in them, and a lot of grapefruit, which is funny because there's neither bananas nor grapefruits in the drink, right? That is a figment of our olfactory imagination but it's there, we experience it, it's, it's real for us, and that's all that matters. That is a phenomenal drink. It looks great, it tastes great. If you like bitter drinks, I know for certain that this drink will be right up in your alley. It is sort of a tiki answer to a Boulevardier or a Negroni. I wanna say thank you to Luxardo and Anchor Distilling for supporting the show. Uh, we are so privileged to have them as partners. I wanna say thank you to the fans for watching the show and subscribing to the show, which I know you're gonna do. Uh, and I will see you again next week with another drink here at How to Drink.